It's smart, you don't stain in it. It's like that Filipino place that we ate. They do similar to it. Oh yeah, actually. Yeah, they put the seafood on it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you eat it with your hand. Yeah. So today we're gonna have some fresh water snail. We call it Urangi. Urangi? Yeah. Yeah, let's see. As long as I don't recognize it. <laughs> yeah, I don't think you're gonna see it. You know what I'm. Don't tell me what it is until I finish the meal. <laughs> okay. Later you can tell me. <laughs> this is I'm in it being adventurous. <laughs> I like it. I never tried snail and I never wanted to try snail because in Europe they eat the slurpy ones, you know? I'm scared of that, yeah, so I never, never had that. But these ones I like, they're cooked. They're good. Yeah. Those snails, they actually grow like right yeah. next to our place. Yeah, we can actually pick them up and make it ourselves. It's nice. It's not slimy as I was expecting. You know, I expected those ones. Oh no, you... it's not slimy at all. Oh no, 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 I would not eat that either. But I think in France, that's why they eat. They yeah, slurp yeah, them. I, I, I've had them on the table a few times, but I never touched them. This one is is fine. This is this is good. Do you wrap the rice? With it? Mm -hmm. Actually, it tastes crunchy. It's not slimy. I When I was little, my grandma used to scare me that if I eat snails, I'm gonna get like parasites and stuff. Oh yeah, if you eat it raw. For me, after that, <laughs> any type <laughs> became a no. <laughs> We killed the phobia of um, snails. <laughs> <laughs> good, good. I'm curious to try this. Is this apple? Yeah, I think it's an apple. Mm, it's an apple. Mm -hmm. Apple salad. Mm. This is like a coleslaw. We had a few times. Cucumbers, dry grape. How do you call it? Uh, Raisin. I like this. <laughs> uh, and do you know what this is? Soybean tofu soup. Yeah, and we call it in Korean Cheonggukjang. 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 That's strong taste, but I like it. Mm -hmm. It's a fermented bean, so it smells a little bit. Yeah, but it's actually really healthy for you. I like that. <laughs> it's a bit bitter once when you take it, first time when you take it, but it goes away really fast. You feel other flavors. It feels, it's thick, it feels super good. I like it. I like the taste of tofu. Actually, even me as a Korean, I think that's strong one. As Eastern Europeans, we eat a lot of pickled and fermented stuff, but we eat on a daily basis. Especially if your grandmas are cooking. It's very healthy. There's a lot of veggies. And it's some rice. Chill popping. Challenge. 
<laughs> Good job. Which time? It's not spicy. It's not spicy as I expected by the color. What meat is that? Pork. Pork. I like everything. Cool. What would you rate this out of 10? Actually, it feels very like homemade, so we have a 10 out of 10. Really? Yeah. I like homemade, homemade feeling. Okay. So I would rate the 10 out of 10. I'm not that demanding when it comes to food. Except for the pancake. Except for the pancake. <laughs> pancake, there are certain certain rules that should be followed for the pancake. I couldn't, uh, they, usually outside of Serbia, people eat the uh, crabs. They call it crab and pancake. In Serbia, we don't have crab, we don't have pancake. Mm -hmm. But that's the thing, we call it a pancake, but it's a thin. And how we make it in Serbia, I never tried it anywhere else. So. Since I left Is Serbia, I haven't had the proper pancake. Is it soft? It's soft. We don't have those crunchy ones in Thailand. Mm -hmm. I never saw that. So we eat them salty and we eat them sweet. But, but we put, you know, plasma, the thing that we have, like a cracker. We blend that and then we put it on with some, uh, we call it Euro Creme or Nutella, you can choose. Or you can do some homemade jam. Put plasma in some milk and then you spread it all over. And then some rosemary, strawberry, whatever. And then you roll it and then you eat it. It's super tasty. But no one does it. <laughs> no one does it. This looks super tasty. Mm -hmm. I think it's a corn flake flavor. Yeah, I just want to say it tastes like a mm -hmm. pork milk. I like it. Also, like they're all boneless. Super convenient to eat. Yeah, exactly. When you have bones, then you're done. Mm -hmm. And I think this one is honey, the behind one is a spicy one. Should we try how spicy it is? Uh, they say it's gonna be equivalent to Sin Ramen, the ramen, so I think you can handle it. Let's see. Okay, this one is as well nice. Mm -hmm. Hot, isn't it? Mm. It's spicy, but not bad spicy. Mm -hmm. It just stays in your tongue, you know, in your in your mouth. And it's tasty. Mm, very good. Glad yeah. you like it. Mm -hmm. I need to turn this burn out. <laughs> I love the culture of mm -hmm. chicken. Mm. In most places outside, when we go, in foreign countries, they have they all put the Korean chicken, Korean chicken. Yeah, Korean chicken is really popular. Mm. In Korea, it's just my taste here. It's not dry. This is my favorite, mm -hmm. Korean. I think fried chicken itself actually stems from the American food culture. And KFC? Yeah, KFC is actually one of them. American chickens are original. Mm -hmm. uh, but I think Korean people modified it and made it more creative. I think they made it better, yeah. Definitely. I think the KFC chicken mm -hmm. is very close to this. <laughs> I don't like it. Really? Yeah, Korean tends to have more sweetness to it. They put a lot of other spices on it, but Korean people makes it like to make it a little sweet. Yeah. Yeah, and spicy at the same time. And that's why I that's why I figured. I remember I asked you, like, everything that you thought it's salty was the best thing for I don't know if I can get it. You have to ask. Are we allowed to give him something or...? Mm, they're not. They're probably not good for the uh, puppy. You can, you can enjoy watching 
<laughs> You're torturing him. I don't know how to help. I'm sorry. I can give you your stack. Can I give him this? I try. I'm so sorry, Mr. Obsidian. You cannot have anything. I hear the conflict. Like, can I give you your stack? Try. Now he wants more. But maybe I remove the meat. A nice meat. He loves it. Mm. Good, good. Mm -hmm. I found something that's not. <laughs> yeah, in Korea, when people say, I want to eat chicken, chicken mokko shippo, when they say that, it means, I want to have a fried chicken. When we say the word in Korean, when you say chicken, that means fried chicken, nothing else. Okay. Yeah, you any other dish. Yeah. So basically, it's like a mandatory thing, mm -hmm. fried chicken. Yeah. Other dishes, uh, we call it tak. Tak? Yeah, tak means chicken. Takogi. Takogi. Yeah. Awesome. Do you like takogi? My little chimmy. Do you like? My chimmy doesn't like them anymore. <laughs> he lost interest. He lost interest. He was like, no more chicken for me. Bye bye. Is it true? I came back from the week. You have grilled chicken? Mm hmm. Barbecue chicken? But Serbia don't have a fried chicken, really? Like this? Mm -hmm. I don't um, Really? Uh, maybe something new opened recently. Mm -hmm. They're opening a lot of new restaurants back home, but... But then we had it in Thailand. And I find this in Korea, it's much tastier. Either the one in Thailand is nice, but... Mm -hmm. He's not giving up. <laughs> So the thing about Korean people do is that they put this, they eat this uh, radish. Mm -hmm. This is ra like pickled radish. Mm -hmm. I, I personally, I don't like eating it, but like some people love to eat it. Like, so it's kind of mandatory thing. So when you order like a, a fried chicken in Korea, like it doesn't matter what brand, they actually give you this radish. I actually like it, it goes nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, people say uh, the chicken might be a little too greasy. Korean people doesn't really like too greasy food, so yeah, can, they kind of neutralize it with this. Yeah, but I never actually had like very heavy food in Korea. Oh yeah, Korean in general they don't really have a heavy greasy food. Yeah, you guys are healthy, you know, like for sweet 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 <laughs> No, we eat a lot of ice cream too. Nice cream, come to Serbia, there's pie, another pie, more pie, then there's cake, and then there's more cake. You can gain weight easily in Serbia. Mm -hmm. Yes, that's true.